think a small combination of, of, of things. Like, like many people, um, I had uh, encountered some very inspirational teachers and, and mentors when I was in, in, in high school. But I also was always very, um, uh, I always gravitated towards math and, and, and science. I was a math science kid. And uh, that sort of seemed like that's where my, my, my talents lay and not elsewhere. So I, it was fairly, um, quite early in, in high school, I already knew that was going to be my trajectory. Oh, I, I think gravity. Uh, all, all, all children's first experiments are gravity. If I drop this, what happens? And in most cases, the answer is, it breaks. You know, I think my favorite thing about it is, um, is that it's sort of, it's 24-7, it's and there's no schedule on which you think up ideas and, and, and try things. And it's it, the sort of the flexibility of being able to to think and, 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 and build and try out ideas is, is my favorite part of being a scientist. Curiosity. A person should always have curiosity, look for answers to, to things. And if they don't make sense, to, you know, look again. So I think it would be hard to say, oh, I made this one wi widget, and look, it's, it lights up half of New York City for a penny an hour. It, that's not the kind of research I, I, I do. I think the societal uh, benefits come more from uh, how we understand the universe and how we understand the physical laws that, that govern uh, the world we live in and, um, and you know, the training of students and, and sort of generation of, of ideas and technologies is, is sort of where it lies. A, a few people, um, my PhD advisor, Ray Weiss, my postdoc advisor, who was uh, Stan Whitcomb, and you know, some of the people who've had sort of the most influence on my thinking are actually my students because we conjure up ideas together and we, we have exchange and back and forth. So I actually learn uh, as much from my students as I do from my mentors. Usually, the, the thing that surprises people the most is uh, that people see me as an, as an astrophysicist because I look for, I'm looking for astrophysical objects in the sky. But yet, I do quantum physics, and I'm thinking about quantum physics uh, on human-scale objects. And these are two very, very incongruous things together. So it always surprises people, well, how do you do that? Definitely my students. So uh, a very eclectic mu music taste. So e everything from world to electronica to classic rock, it, 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 it varies by mood.